Hi guys doing and welcome to another R Garage video. If you want to see more Alfa Romeo related content subscribe to our channel and hit notification button. Today we're gonna be checking out the accuracy of the odometer on this 147 but you can use the same process to check out the odometer on any Alfa Romeo model. Uh, for this I got a set of uh, cables on Amazon for 40 euros and multi ECU free software. Uh, I'll put a link for both of those things uh, in the description below. Uh, this is what I'll spend my 40 euros on this blue KKL cable. Uh, I got one more ELM black cable and these different adapters which are used to communicate with different car modules. This green one for example is used to communicate with car ECU and uh, uh, ABS module if I remember right. You also need uh, this version of multi ECU scan software which you can get on their website for free. First thing we gotta do we gotta take our blue KKL cable and connect it to the green adapter which is in charge for the connection with the car ECU. Here's our OBD2 connector. We just gotta plug it in. Uh, I'm gonna open the device manager on my PC. We gotta check out the serial port we are using. As you can see right here, we are using the COM12. Now we're gonna go back to our program. We're gonna click on settings. And we gotta check out if COM12 is selected, which it is. Now if this field was empty, you would have to select COM12 yourself. We're gonna do a quick test. Everything looks great. I'm gonna hit OK. Uh, we've selected engine and Bosch Motronics 731. And we're connecting to the ECU. Uh, let's see if there are any codes. There are none. Uh, here is the extensive list of parameters. Uh, we are actually only interested in few with the odometer one, uh, odometer atlas programming and number of programmings. This odometer readout is going to be based on the calculation by the car ECU. And as you can see right here, uh, we are getting the readout of 138,586 which is uh, about 10k of kilometer in difference compared to the readout we get on our dash but that's actually normal I've tested numerous cars the readout difference varies from couple of thousand all the way up to 10 12 thousand uh, as you can see number of programmings we got zero and the odometer at last programming is zero kilometers all of these numbers uh, basically tell us that nobody rolled back the odometer on this car and everything looks exactly like it's supposed to. Uh, I got this diagnostic tool maybe like two years ago but honestly I'm not using it too much lately since I got the Autel MK908. Uh, I'm not sure if you can do the same thing with cheaper diagnostic tools but uh, I went for this one because as you can see right here you can do active tests and uh, adjustment of the newly installed components so since this one costs only like 40 euros I decided to go the for this one uh, that's it for this video if you liked it hit subscribe button and hit thumbs up